What's up, everybody? Welcome back to our channel. Scary, right? I know. You guys, I just washed my hair. No extensions today. And if you're new to my channel, the reason why my hair looks like this is because I will show you at the end. I always do it like this to get volume in my hair, so I figured I'd show you guys. All right, you guys. My face, my foundation is done. I use my... It's funny because I use my Makeup Forever, which to me is not, um, it's not full coverage. Do you know what I'm saying? So I want to show you my other one that I love is this. So I mix these two together. These two together are a dream, but <clears throat> I can't find my favorite foundation anywhere. The Too Faced Vanilla, like literally is my favorite foundation of them all. All right, you guys. So I'm just going to set my foundation a little bit. And today, I'm going to use the Makeup Forever powder. I don't know if you guys have seen this before. I'm sure you guys have. You guys, I have a ton of this stuff. It's humongous. And the only reason why I got it is, was because I got it from Makeup Forever um, when I was there. So, I'm just going to pat this on right here. And then we'll wipe this off later on. So, this is what I'm going to set my face with. And it's great for the camera because you can't see the white if you know what i'm saying all right you guys are you ready for this tutorial for the manny mua palette first off you guys know my channel is usually about like let's just say hauls and showing you guys the new products that just came out and all that amazing stuff so if you're looking to get like a perfect look i'm not saying that it's going to come from me that's all i'm saying all right you guys first i'm going to start out because i got new lashes and I can't stand wearing new lashes for the first time so I'm just gonna lay them here like this before I even put my mascara on and these are the the Allure 202 as you guys can see I just want to show you guys something I want to show you how big they are for my eye because my eyes are so small you see that so I have to cut I'm going to cut part of it so they will be ready for later when we when we do this, my friends. I'm so excited. I really am super, super excited about this video, you guys. I told you I would do it for you guys. You know, I'm not a big tutorial person. I love doing the get ready with me's. Okay, so that one's going to be good. I definitely recommend you guys doing that when you're putting your lashes on. Do it before you put your mascara on. Like measure them. Like look at that. Look at how big that is. And again, it's because my eyes are so small and so hooded, I literally have to take a lot off the lashes. I mean a lot. All right, so my lashes are ready to go. And let's start with the eyes with this amazing freaking palette that I am freaking pumped about. Really, really, really excited about, you guys. Okay, so this is the Manny MUA palette, as you all know, if you saw it in my previous video. He is hot. He's like a really, like... He's hot, like a really good-looking freaking guy. Like, my goodness gracious. Um, okay, so what am I going to start with? I am going to start with my MAC and Painterly. And we are going to get busy, my friends. My eyes, listen, you guys, my eyes are really, really small. Just so you know, and they're really, really hooded. So it's very hard for me when I give you eye tutorials. Like, I don't mind doing tutorials on anything else. But eyes for me is the hardest part. But you know what? This channel is about everything. And you guys know this channel is not perfect. So, well, it's perfect for us because we have a lot of fun on here. But I'm just saying, you guys know how I roll. So I'm going to go in with MAC. You guys can use whatever primer you have. I just happen to still love this one. I know a lot of people don't. How funny was that, you guys, with the Urban Decay? Like, when I opened it up and I expected a wand there, like, what was I thinking? Really, what was I thinking? You guys, I have not planned this out. As you guys know, every time I come on here, I just wing it. I always wing my looks. So, that's just how we roll. And you know what, too? That's how we learn. So, that's the great part about this channel. And, you know, I didn't make up the name, you guys, um makeup by Shay. I don't know if you guys know that. My son did. And he's like, Mom, you need to make it up. Makeup by Shay. Makeup by Shay. And I really didn't want makeup by Shay. I wanted like, you know, like something about 
I don't know, product reviewing and all that stuff. And he was like, no, mom, no. So he literally, first of all, I didn't even know how to use the computer like that. So he literally made everything for me. And since he did that, I can never change my name and nor would I. All right, let me zip it and let's get into this palette, you guys, that I'm really excited for. And the reason why I do put tape on my eyes very lightly, I have my foundation on, but I will go over my foundation again. It's just because of the fact my eyes are so hooded. All right, so what color are we going to go into first? I don't know. I think I'm going to go in with Beaches and Cream. Yes, this one right there. Oh, you guys. I own this color, you guys, and I love it. And I'm just going to put this all over my lid. Now, I'm going to try to make a look that looks good because my eyes are so freaking hooded. Like, really. Like, insurance needs to cover this so I can get an eye lift. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they are. They are very, very hooded. But they always were. But it's all good. We could work with it. It's very hard to, but we'll do this. So what are you guys thinking of the Man MUA palette, you guys? You guys excited for it or what? Let me know. Leave your comments below. I would love to know. Makeup Geek is just a freaking an amazing company. And their shadows are so high quality. And you guys know I am the hugest Kat Von D fan. And when I said I compare this to Kat Von D palette, that you guys know if you know my channel, that's saying something huge, right? All right, so we went in with Beaches and Cream. Now I think I'm going to go in with, hmm, Sora, Sora, Sora. Sorry, you guys. And yes, um, okay, remember yesterday I said Luna meant crazy? And so you, if, if you guys don't know, my husband is Spanish, so he's like, are you freaking crazy? It's loco, a loco, what, well, I don't know how to say it correctly. But then it is true. One of my subscribers told me that Luna is also, people use it now as a slang for crazy. That's, that's what I heard from one of my subscribers. Yes. So now people are using it as different terms. You know, you get what I'm saying, right? So, you guys, um, we're going to be starting an anti-bully video. If you are interested, please comment below. Let me know. We want to work with as many people as possible. It's going to be amazing. Um, I have my friend Jake, Luna. If you don't know his channel, check it out. I'm going to do the slogan, and he's going to design the shirts. So, it's going to be an amazing video. And we would like to get as many people as we can to collab in this video. So definitely give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. Let me know if you're interested. It doesn't matter how many channels, I mean, how many subscribers you have. I don't roll like that at all. And I never will. Ever. If I like you and I like your channel, I collab. That's how I roll. All right. So Sora, great, great color, great transition color. Transition, transition color. I'm trying to make this not too funky, too dark. Well, actually, I have parent-teacher conference, so I need to get rid of my necklace. I don't want them thinking I'm crazy, which I am. Okay, so that's perfect right there, right, you guys? Now, I want to go in with the big guns. And you see how I put this? I want to show you guys something. You see this? See how hooded my eyes are right there? It is so hard for me to get like that cut crease that everybody does like god i just wish i could do it or like you know maybe these big guys these big youtubers could do like a giveaway on spending a day with them and, and teach us some stuff here because i need to learn my friends all right so i am going to be going in with mars and manny did say i saw he commented on one of my uh, when I commented on one of his videos, he's going to be doing a video on this. So I'm really excited about that. He's going to be doing a video on this color, Mars. So you guys, I'm just putting it all in here like this. Like I have to. Because of my lid. And you'll see why. But we'll fix it. If it doesn't come out good, don't worry about it. 
it's just makeup. But you guys asked for it, so you got it. And I'm going to bring it out a little bit. This color is freaking incredible. When I tell you incredible, holy shit, the pigmentation on here. Look at the pigment. Like, wow, wow, wow. You don't have to get this funky, you guys, with the palette. I tend to like color, so it doesn't matter for me as long as it looks good. And you just have to keep blending. You see that? And like I blend right there and it goes right on the tape. I just have to say I love you guys and I thank you so much for all your freaking support. Seriously, I really, really do. It's overwhelming. Like it's overwhelming. And you guys are right. Like I don't know why I, I put myself down sometimes, which I shouldn't. Because I am the bomb. So that's what I'm going to keep saying to myself. You know what I mean? I'm just kidding. <laughs> so I really want to know if you guys got this palette. Or if you plan on picking it up. If you don't. If you, if you don't wind up getting it, you need to order the shades that are permanent in this palette. That's for sure. Because I use those all the time. Like that Makeup Geek palette that I showed you guys is my go-to palette every day. Every single day. That and the Kat Von D Shade and Light palette. I'm loving this color. You see how this eye is so much more hooded than this one? This one's like literally dragging down to my eye. Yeah, I'm going to see the doctor about that. They need to hook this up. It's called a blethroplasty. I know just from working in the operating room for so long. That that's what it's called. Alright, so now that I got this Mars all over. Freaking love it. Love it, love it. You know what's cool too about this? I haven't seen a color like this. You guys, good thing I put my foundation on first. Because this video would have been freaking long. Alright, so the next color I'm going to go into is Luna. Yes, which means the moon. And it also means crazy believe it or not i'm going in you guys with a freaking wet and wild brush with which i love for patting on color i think it's freaking amazing and i'm just gonna spray it not that i have to but it's just a force of habit that i always do so this is what i'm gonna do i'm gonna pack this color on look at that bam in your face yes i'm just gonna pat it right there as you can see i have no lid literally no frigging lid at all which really sucks so if i take it like this and just pat it onto the lid space i only have it'll be good but you see how intense this color is like it's just it's beautiful you guys it really really is beautiful so i'm going to go back in again and go into like where my crease is just because look at that did you ever see anybody with eyes as jacked up as mine? I mean, let's be for real here. That's why I work so hard on any look that I do just because of the fact of, uh, what do you call it? I got no lid. I mean, really got no freaking lid. So I'm so excited for the collab video. You guys, this is going to be amazing. There's going to be so many of you that it's just going to be off the hook. It really, really is. So I'm just patting this on here like this. And then I'm going to go back in with another color. Because you guys know I like some bright colors. But I can't have it this bright. For my parent teacher conference and a job interview. They'll be like, where is she going? Alright, so I'm going back in with Beaches and Cream. And I'm just going to... Tone this down just a little bit. Not a lot, just a little, because I like the color. I mean, you know, if people want to judge you by the color of the makeup you're wearing. Well, actually, nowadays they will, so, you know, they judge you on any shit. I mean, really, let's be for real. This is 2016, right? We're not thinking 2016 
or are some people forgetting that we live in 2016? I'm going to dip it back into Frappe. And you guys, I own Cosmopolitan. I love that shade. Oh, it's one of the best shades ever. The only reason why I'm not using it right now is because I rock it all the time. But you know what's great about this palette? You don't have to go into another palette for anything, for nothing. Look at that. For nothing. I'm loving, loving, loving it. So I'm just going to keep blending. And you guys can give me your honest opinion on what you think on the look. Because you're not going to hurt my feelings. Because you guys know, like, I should call this the learning channel from Makeup by Shay. That would have been cool. Okay, let's go in with a little Cosmopolitan. Just because I do like this color. And you see how that tones that down right there like that? Oh, these two colors together. Look at the color it makes. That's what I love. Like you can mix and match these colors together. So basically, I'm just mixing them away. I really don't care. Look at that. The pigment is ridiculous, my friends. Ridiculous. I freaking love it. Love it, love it. Do you guys believe that like spring is already freaking here? Like seriously? I'm really excited about that because this weather in New York sucks. Yes, it does. All right, so that is enough of Cosmo. Okay, now what I'm going to do, you guys, is should I put a little brown in there too? Try to get all the colors in here for you guys. Make it a little bit dark over there. Hmm. Should I do that? What do you guys think? Like I'm talking to you guys as if like you're here and you could tell me what to do. <laughs> All right, let's do that. I'm going to go in with the darkest shade. And you guys, Aphrodite. Aphrodite. What amazing collab. What an amazing collab is all I have to say. I'm just going to darken this up right here. I don't go too dark in, you guys, because of my eyes. But you guys can do whatever the frig you want. Because it's only makeup. So I'm just darkening it a little bit right here at the end. Listen, are you guys signed up for the Sephora subscription box? Because I'm not, but I'm seeing a lot of people are aren't they're mad that other people have it so now i don't know if i want it because i saw my friend do a video on it and she's actually uh oh my god she's actually doing a giveaway on her channel on it so if i were you guys i'd go watch her you guys my 2k giveaway is coming soon i'm really excited Super, super excited. I am almost at 2,000 subscribers. That is friggin' bomb right there. Wow, you guys, I love mixing these colors. But as you can see, see how hard that is for me? Like, this is real, live action. No editing, no nothing. And you guys like that I don't do that. All right, so I'm going to take tape off. Bam, look at that. Love, love, love when I use the tape. And then I'll go back in with my beauty blender that already has the foundation on it just to touch it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Love that. Now we're going to go in with my favorite shade of the palette. <laughs> They're actually all my favorite shades, you guys, but this is like truly... First, no, I'm lying. First, I'm going to go in with Sora again, Okay. I'm going to go in with Sora, and we're going to put this on the lash line. Do you see? Do you see, like, how pigmented that is? Crazy, crazy, craziness. It's so freaking pigmented. But all her eyeshadows are. So, if you're going to buy MAC, you guys, you might as well buy Makeup Geek. Because it's cheaper, and actually... 
they're better. Unless it's like some color you really want from MAC. It, but it's cheap. And so is the shipping. On regular stuff, the shipping is like $1.99. So I'm doing this right now with Sora. And then I'm going to go in with the big one. Insomnia. And I'm going in using the same brush. I'm not going to wet it yet. I want to see how it comes on. This is my favorite color. This and Mars. I don't know. Maybe not. I love them all. So what are you guys thinking? Yes, I'm doing this for you guys. Not for me. For you guys. You guys ask, you shall receive. Can you imagine, you guys, if I would have done my foundation and this and that, how long this video would have been? Like, seriously, how long is this video already? 21 minutes. Holy shit. I'm sorry, you guys. I really am. But you guys told me you like my long videos, right? Be honest here, you guys. If you want them shorter, I'll make them shorter. But I got to be honest with you. When I do a tutorial, it, it kind of can be. Number one, I'm talking too much. Number two, I'm trying my hardest. Because I'm not this fancy-ass makeup artist. Just a regular girl doing makeup. That has a channel for us to learn. Look at that. Look at that. I could just keep going with this color. All day long. Insomnia. Holy moly. And I'm getting really, really close to my inner corner right there. Some people like it light in the inner corner. I like this color right here. It's banging. It's banging, my friends. Then I'm even going to put a little more here. I know I'm going a little crazy now. I need to slow my roll. I can't help it. All right, so that's insomnia. And because insomnia has like so many different colors in it, you guys, which is amazing. I'm going to show you what I'm going to use. I'm going to show you what I'm going to use inside my lash line, which you guys, I recommend this to you guys. I know I always say it. It is like one of the two things I only own from NARS, and that is Barrel Street. You guys need this. You need this in your life for real. Watch this. Watch how Barrel Street just like literally just makes your eyes pop. And when I tell you it doesn't move, it doesn't move. Besides this eyeliner and I think Inglot, the only two eyeliners that stay in my eyes. And did you guys know that Makeup Geek is coming out with eyeliners? I want to show you the card that was in the box. I can't wait for her to come out with her own foundation. That's going to be amazing. All right, look, you see that? Your eyes are just like, bam, pop in. All right, just in case you don't want to see me put my lashes on, I'm going to do my lip first. You guys, use this. It's the best lip primer ever, literally like ever, okay? All right, first let's um, bronze up this face because it is freaking white as a ghost. I'm going in with Mac Gimme Sun, and I don't know why it doesn't come on the way like Desi does it. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, do you ever see her do her Mac Gimme Sun and her bronzer? Like, you would think mine would show up more because I'm so much paler. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's this film. This film on it right there. Don't know. Thinking if I should tone it down, but I really don't want to. Because I really like the look. Alright, we'll bronze this up. The blush I'm going to show you guys, you need this. Holy shit, you guys need this. Seriously, like, no joke. It is one of the bl best blushes out there. I know I always say it. Or maybe I shouldn't use that blush because it, it'll be, like, too much. Yeah, you know what? I'm not. I'm going to use Rockator. I don't want to go crazy here. All right, let me do my eyes first. Now, if you don't want to learn how to put eyelashes on, you guys don't have to watch 
the rest of this video, but I need to do it anyway, so I'm just gonna go do my lashes. I'm using Galani mascara. Actually, I'm doing it wrong. People with hooded eyes, definitely, you should definitely do your mascara on the bottom first. That I'm gonna tell you right now. So just do it on the bottom first. And I'll explain that to you why. Because you see how I'm looking down and I'm doing all this stuff. You put it on the top of your eyelash. Like, look, it just hit the top. The mascara gets on there right there. So I do the opposite. I always put my mascara on my bottom lashes first now. I have to. I don't have a choice. It's all good, my friends. All good. Oh, you guys been asking me if you guys been asking me. Um, I do have a P.O. box now. Yes, I do. Very excited. Um, because. Sorry. I'm very excited to get a P.O. box. A lot of you guys are asking me for my address and stuff like that. So, you know what? I said, let me get a P.O. box. And I did. And it is in my description box. In case you guys were wondering. So, I don't go crazy with the mascara because I know I'm putting false lashes on. Which, I miss my false lashes from Benefit because they just freaking broke. Those are my favorite lashes too. They're called pinups, you guys. Need to try them. Alright, let's put these lashes on. And then for lips, I'm doing Kat Von D. And I'm going to mix two of them. Yes, I am. As a matter of fact, let's do the lips. Ah, uh, I am using Nose Fur and Double Dare. Frigging love this combo. So Nose Fur is first. <laughs> I, I just freaking love her lipstick. We all know that I overdraw my lips. Which is your preference. You can do whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? Then I'm going to put double dare over this. Or maybe I shouldn't. I like this color. You know what? I'm going to wait. I'm not even putting double dare over that. All right. Let's put these lashes on. You guys, lashes complete the look. Like, literally complete the look. I'm using the duo glue. And hopefully we don't have a hard time with these lashes. Because when I use lashes for the first time, sometimes they give me a hard time. When I use them for like two or three days, they're just like so easy and, you know, just a, like very, very amazing to put on. So let's see, my friends, what you guys think. And you'll know when your lashes are on, right? Because you can feel the coldness literally on your eye. And I can't stand when there are fresh pair of lashes. I know that sounds weird, but I can't stand it. Because they're really not molded to your eye yet. But we're going to roll with this. And I'm going to put some liner on top of it later. Not with you guys here because this video is freaking so long. So, don't you see how, like, the lashes make a big freaking difference in my eyes? Because they're so jacked up. Mm-hmm. Yes, they are. So, oh, any of you guys, that's what I want to ask you, too. Get your hands on the Kylie Lip Kits. Because I'm over that already. Like, so over it. I want them. But, like, really? Do people have to buy 24 of them and sell them on freaking eBay? That is, like, just crazy bullshit and should be illegal. It should be illegal. One lash is always easier than the other. That is for sure. And that's why I go so high up with my color, you guys. Because look, 
by the time I put my lashes on, it's not even like you could see my eyeshadow that much. So, I am loving this look. As a matter of fact, I'm going to go back in. Not right now, because you guys, this video is so freaking long. You guys are probably like, what the fridge, Jay? You are a freaking disaster. Your videos are too long. I'm going in with Rockateur. Yes, I love Benefit. Love it, love it, love it. You guys, I'm loving the lip with this look. Let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up. You know what's funny? Somebody loves to come to my channel before it's like the video even starts and gives it a thumbs down. I crack up. Like, I literally crack up. Because I know who it is. And they're so, it's just so stupid. Who does that? Like, who has time for that shit? And to tell you the truth, on YouTube, I don't think that they should have the thumbs down button there at all. I don't know. That's my opinion. You guys, let me know what you think. All right, let's take this hair out in case you want to see. If you already clicked off my video, no big deal. I understand because it's very, very long. But we have to show you the finished look, right? And that's including the hair. So you guys see why I put the roller in there? Because it just makes my hair so freaking high. <laughs> but I got to fix this too off camera because I do have to go in and curl it. But before I curled it, I literally like just wanted volume. My hair is so dead. It's breaking. I got to go use different products that, what's her name recommended? Oh my God. How do I not remember her? And she's one of my favorite YouTubers. Ready, set, glamour. She did a video on her hair. So if I were you guys, I'd go watch it. And I would also go watch Manny's video that's coming out that he's doing this palette with. So you guys, yes. I think I look like Madonna, like back in the 80s look with my choker on. <laughs> anyway, you guys, let me know what you think of this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know if you are digging the look. I'm going to go fix my eyelashes and um, do a little touch up, but I just didn't want this video to be that long. And it's already 32 minutes, you guys. So I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Have a great day and I will see you in our next video. Ciao, my friends.